Hey everyone, and welcome back to the Brugly channel. I'm your host, Brugly, and in this video, I'm actually going to be going over two Backrooms levels, level 34 and level 35. These levels are both pretty short on their own, so I decided to just throw them into the same video for your enjoyment. Hope you do enjoy it, and I hope you're having a great day. Thank you for watching the video, and let's get into two levels. So starting off, I'm doing level 34, which is classified as a class 5 difficulty and is very dangerous. I mean, it's an entity-filled sewer system with water. How could it not be dangerous? The level itself is a claustrophobically small tunnel that's only around 4 feet tall, so you're gonna have to crouch if you walk through it. There's no light source on the level itself, so if you want to come here, you're gonna want to bring a flashlight so you can see. The main entity you're gonna have to worry about as well is Smilers, since they like to hide in dark habitats, and this level is the very definition of a dark habitat. The tunnel itself is full of dirty water. It doesn't say if it's sewage or not, because uh, that would be nasty if it was, but the thing that makes this level so weird is that no one knows how the Smilers stay alive. Like, what do they eat? It's a small enclosed level with no other things in there, you know? The level also kind of reminds me of that tunnel from Indiana Jones when they were going into like the tunnels under France or whatever, you know? There are not any bases or outposts here, since you can't set anything up in a four foot tunnel, and to enter, you can go inside a sewer grate on level 11. Don't know why you want to do that, but oh well. To exit, you can find an area where two tunnels meet, like a junction area, and when you find that place, you can just dive right into the water and swim straight down, and you'll end up on either level 7 or level negative 2. And you can exit also by climbing up a ladder to a sewer grate and opening it, which will take you to level 9, 81, or 11. But yeah, that was the entire entry for level 34. It's short, and that's why I'm putting level 35 in this video as well. But I think I would hate this level because I really don't like claustrophobic spaces, and I also don't like walking around in dirty water. And that's literally all this level is. Plus, there's creatures hiding in the dark that want to eat you. So I tried to skip this level in any way possible. On to level 35. Level 35 is classified as a class 2 difficulty and is unsafe with a low entity count. The level itself looks like a car park that's dimly lit, but it also has different colored lights throughout the level. The actual parking area is just surrounded by a completely black abyss, which should be avoided completely because no one knows what even is out there. Even though there isn't much light inside of the complex, there's the light that's here is a bunch of different colors like green and blue, and there's also the typical fluorescent lights as well. In total, there are six floors with a roof on top, so the level is not infinite, and it's actually one of the smallest levels in the backrooms. For the most part, the parking lots are completely empty. Hardly any cars. But there are some random cars around, which can make weird things happen once you get in them. For instance, if you get into a 2015 Ford Fusion, well then nothing happens. But if you get into an ambulance, sirens will start to blast and you'll be sent to level 14. If you get into a Humvee, then you'll be sent to level 49. If you get into one of those funeral hearses, then you'll just instantly unalive. So, <laughs> don't do that. If you get into a Caprice, then loud engines will start and the music will just blast so loud until you get out. And if you get into a school bus, then you might get mauled by a Smiler because that's where most of the Smilers are on the level. And there's a couple of other ones like Jeeps and ice cream trucks that should probably be just completely avoided. The good news is, is that there's a ton of exits in the level. But the exits that aren't the cars need to be avoided because if you get near one, like an exit door or something like that, then the entire parking lot will fill up with moving cars that will try to run you over. Now if this does happen and you notice you just stepped really close to an exit door, you gotta run to the first parked car you see, except if it's a hearse, and get into it so you can get out of there because you don't want to get trampled by a car. Trust me. There are not any bases here and you can enter by breaking through a brick wall on level 34 and you can exit through one of the car exits that I talked about. So yeah, that was Backrooms Levels 34 and Levels 35. I hope you enjoyed it. Like I said, those are two short entries and I just wanted to throw them together so you can get a longer video. Hope you enjoyed it. 
Thank you for everything you're doing. Thank you for watching Berkeley Summer Spectacular. I hope your summers are going great. I know mine is. It's a great summer. Make the most of it. Go do some stuff. It's a vibe. Also, go check out my second channel, Tugly. I'm trying to get to 50K over there. I'm uploading some bangers, and I really think you're going to enjoy what's over there. I mean, I do. If you like my content and you like me, then you're definitely going to like what I'm doing over there. Thank you for watching the video. Thank you for supporting me, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.